Hi, I'm Mark Breeze, and I'm going to show you today how to use a plugin that I use regularly, um, which is the Own Boys uh, delay plugin made by Own Force. Um, and I've got it on a few parts that I've used previously in tracks. And I'm going to show you today how I would use the plugin very simply in layman's terms um, to get the desired effect. I'm not going to go into any details of how it works or LFOs or any of that stuff that's in in the plugin. All I'm going to do is show you the very basics to get that desired effect quick. Okay, so here's a few parts um, from a track I've been recently working on. Um, there's a guitar part here, which is a dry sound. I'm going to play you now. So a very dry sound there. Um, and I've got the plug-in set on the channel here in the first rack. I've used a very short delay here. So I'm going to show you what it sounds like now. That's the plug-in off. And that's the plug-in on. Now that's obviously a very short delay on there, but you can change the timings quite easily here. Um, I shall flick through them, stop and start it, so you can kind of tell how it sounds um, with different timings on it. You can see that's a very short tail there. Whereas if I change it here to say three quarters of a beat, a slightly longer tail off um, and here I use the frequency quite a lot to um, determine how the delay is going to roll off whether it be um, quite thick or thin depending on the frequency of what the um, delay tail off will be so I shall show you if I turn that up you'll get a more of a sharper very thin there if I pull it back a bit Made it thin there around 1k just sort of um, so it's in the background there and it doesn't mess up or muddy up any of the guitar sound. If I pulled that right down into the same sort of frequency of probably where the guitar is, let's try 150. You can tell there it's kind of keeping the same frequency as the guitar and it's filling the space up, making it a bit more um, complete and a bit warmer. Um, you can also add resonance, resonance here just to sort of, um, you'll see here as it pulls the peak of the curve up. Oh, maybe a bit too much there. Thin that out. very nice resonant tail off there. Also I use the plugin for obviously different situations uh, and I've got loaded up here on a send as well because I use it as a send as well as just a plugin um, on each individual channel and here I've got it set up <coughs> for a more of a chorusy sound I think I think that's the chorusy one let's just uh, give that a try. It's actually a more of a filtered type um, a delay cut off. In this slot, I've probably got it set up for chorusing. So this is what the sound sounds like with, with it chorus slightly. I think this is preset number three, um, which I use quite a lot for doubling things up, sort of chorusing them a bit. Um, I'll just mute that part and play you 
a vocal part here. Um, and this is it dry. Listen, hear me, only you can take me. Um, so that's the, the vocal dry, and this is it with um, a chorus type effect that I just used from the Iron Boys. Listen, hear me, only you can take me to heaven. You sent me, so I am at your mercy. You can see it's thickened the sound up straight away. Um, and then when I add it with some filtered delay. Listen, hear me, only you can take me to heaven. You sent me, so I am at your mercy. Very nice. It sounds lovely. I do like that. Um, so here we go. I'm going to show you now um, on our arpeggiate line. How that would sound. I think I've got this set up as a separate plugin. Um, so we're going to go for each one at a time. I think this one I've done as a phaser. So this is the dry up. Okay, and this is it with a phaser on it. show you with a delay even though the um, audio already has a delay on it I've put um, this filtered delay on it now with the, the chorus effect. So there you go, just very quickly there I showed you why that plugin um, is easy to use for me. Um, it, it can give me um, so many different variations of, of um, thickening sounds up from chorusing or a filtered delay or a, fl uh, a phaser or or just a simple straight delay it's it's so easy to use um, it's one of the things I just go straight to and load up um, it's a great little plugin so thanks for your time